I'm going to throw another wild fact at y'all. The cost to borrow rate on Quantum Scape shares is 200%. You cannot short this stock unless you pay a 200% annualized yield. This happens to a lot of companies that IPO. It really forces the upside of the pop. This is what happened to Nikola, why the stock was elevated for such a long time, because you literally cannot find shares to short the stock because the supply is so restricted. And if you can find shares, you're paying a 200% interest rate. You're constantly rolling over that squeeze. And so that's what I see happening is nobody can even get shares to short. And so if I, I think this is a totally uh, irrational market dynamics pushing this to a totally insane, irrational price point that makes no sense. The second the market normalizes, the second the Robinhood hype dies down, the second it gets easy to short and borrow uh, and short this stock, I think it normalizes and, and hits a much more normal equilibrium. But this is just my, my theory. You know, I don't have, I have, I have no position in QuantumScape. Not long, not short, just just a schemer. But uh, this is my thoughts on the company. I who sets the rate? It's the market, and it's really hard to find the the cost to borrow rate for companies. But when I so so, how did I know Tesla was going to short squeeze back in 2012? I'm looking. At, I'm calling up interactive brokers like, yo, I didn't have an account, but I was like, yo, what's the borrow rate on Tesla? They're like, um, excuse me, sir, what's your name? What's your account number? I'm like, oh, I don't need to, just just hit me with the borrow rate, bro. Like, we don't even have to go through that. So that worked for a week, and then they cut me off. But the bar rate, and it was like 80%. And so I'm putting in this spreadsheet, and I'm like, 60%, 80%. And it's a month long. So I'm like, in a month, you paid 15% interest on that position. You're already down 15%, just the interest to keep that stock there. And so, of course, you're going to be forced to cover and cause a massive short squeeze in the company. So this is what happened to Beyond Meat, why it had that insane pop after IPO, looking at 200% borrow rates. And so QuantumScape now is in this irrational zone of lack of shares existing forcing up a borrow rate, making people unallowed to short the stock, and then you you have that no top there. And so that's a really weird back-end market dynamic that I think is uh, inflating the irrationality of this valuation.